name is Andrew Clark, former Premiership player. This is bar level. Hey, this now. So I'm watching, I'm watching the game yesterday, and I'm looking at the screen, and I'm like, hold on a minute, that's something new. I said it on my live, but then reading the paper this morning, yeah. there's actually an article on it. I want to know if you noticed it. Above the score line, yeah, top corner, yeah, there was five tabs to to show you who's got how many subs left. Oh, is that what they do over there now? That's what they were doing over there now. So, I'm reading the paper. It seems fans have clocked it and they're like, yo, why ain't Sky and TNT doing the same thing? Because I was like, that's quite a nice little touch. Good good, good, good technology to know who's who's playing something up. There was a moment where we had five subs still to go and they already had... That's good. Yeah, they had two. They already used three. Yeah, I was like, that's good to see. You don't have to... That is good. I've been in the great team. Yeah, Amazon, Amazon. The only thing I do say, I did laugh at, but I, uh, it's not new, it's something they've done before. It's the halftime interviews, I'm not too sure I'm feeling those. Well, that's a, that's the American thing, isn't it? Catch a coach always walking off the pitch, you know, yeah. you're, you're yeah. winning. What are you, you going to do when they come out in the second half? Uh, that's, that's, yeah. that's a bit inner. They already get them at the end. Is there any need to get them at halftime? But yeah. I remember when we were filming the gym's game. We yeah, 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 yeah. Time. So yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe, maybe it's because I'm not used to it. Maybe no, it's but it's a good thing because you want to catch the you want to catch the me, the momentum, yeah, and the feeling now. of the players at that yeah. particular time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I made a great play. How did you feel? Man, I feel great, man. It's not me damn in, man. What? I want to. And you know, there's some of the players they lose themselves because they want to swear. They're like, man, I want to fucking figure out, man. And they'll be like, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, man, he came over here. Yeah, but he basically, he basically say, man, I want to fuck this. Man, this thing is getting fucked up. Man. <laughs> but I don't think it's a bad thing. I don't think it's a bad thing. I think that. The, 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 right. the, I don't think it's a bad thing. I just found it. The substitute funny. thing is great because what's, what you're gonna find from here, because prop, because prime, remember it's prime that done this. No one else has done it. Sky done it. BT ain't done it. Match of the day. No one ain't done it. This is prime has done it. So now they've got the indicators to know these are the players that are subs. How many subs have we got? Five. So we already know. So the fans will know when well, we got five subs. So the fans are like, man, get another geezer on. Yeah. The fans are involved now. Like, what the fuck? Yeah. Shit, get him on. We got five up there. Get him on there. Yeah, yeah. And um, your fans will scream and see the name. They see the numbers of subs up there with their numbers and the and the subs, the, the players and their names in it. Yeah, no, I li- I like that. I think that was a nice touch. It was smooth, not too loud. It'll get me just there. Couple tabs, boom. You get me? I like that. I think that was a good touch. I was gonna ask you. We already spoke about the halftime interviews. That's cool. Do you think there's anything else like? Little touches like that. Do you think they Yeah, do? yeah. I want to yeah, interview the fucking ref. I want to interview the Betfred refs at half time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. Cause I was able I was when we went to do your team over by there, I interviewed the referee, bro. Yeah, you did. Facts. I I like that that as well. What did I say? This is the he first referee. What did I say? He's he the first shocked. referee ever to speak on camera. <laughs> first ref ever to speak on camera. That's and the referee was even the referee was a good ref, and he, you know, he he has got the IQ of the game, and I asked him, "What do you see?" Da, da, da. And he, you know, he was honest, and he was straight. Yeah, I love that's it. what fans want, bro. That's it. Fans want that. You know what? Well, I think that decision was a bit shit, though. Uh, but don't worry. When I go in the after, I'm gonna check with VAR. I'm gonna check me here with the web. Listen, man, you fucked up there. You, you ain't put me back out and embarrassing me, but make sure this shit's right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, man, you can do that. We're talking about people. This game right here, charity game between Better Gym and Anytime Fitness. We did that. You know what I mean? We was there. We got the whole game. We got the bits before, bits in between. So that's what we're talking about right now. Make sure you go and check that out. It is on the channel. Wicked, bro. Yeah, that, Wicked was, was, that was that, that day was great. That day. That was great. <laughs> that was a- I, need to, I need to, I'm going to be contacting teams because we're going. I'm going to do, we're going to do yeah. women's game, men get, we're going for everything, bro. You yeah, know what man. Mean? That was, I, I enjoyed that. was fun, dude. I enjoyed that. That was great. But yeah, so. All right, referees at half time. I'm thinking yeah, definitely, bro. yellow cards. Who's got yellow card? That should be on the screen. So yeah, fans know what's going on. Yeah, so a man knows what he's on. Yeah, so we don't want to jeopardize the game and jeopardize points and being relegated or being eliminated from some competition. Feel, how do you feel? What about this? I bet you if Amazon get more games, which they haven't, by the way, oh, they've got the most money, they can buy any game. A new, a new, <laughs> yeah, a new deal has come through. 
for some reason, Amazon ain't putting up the dough. I'm shocked because they got dough, but they must be doing their Amazon the hey, what? Hey, what? Because Sky, Sky and TNT, they got the majority. They still, yeah, I know. Still got Where's the TNT they're, not getting, they're not getting outbidded, so yeah. But, yeah, but come on, but TNT, I knew TNT for wrestling, bro. I didn't. <laughs> It should even know. When TNT came when I was seeing it, it was all wrestling. I never saw a ball game on that TNT ever. Then the NFL's got them. They switch up, blood. They switch. They buy BT in it. That's what happens. They bought BT. So TNT. Yeah, TNT bought BT. So there's no more BT sports. That's why they got football now. You get me? Because they just bought that, and every every contract you got, we just take that. You get me? So they got Champions League now. Here's the other thing I want to ask you, Calm. Go on, go on, go on. Here's the other thing I want to ask you. Is it about I'm this topic? Huh? Is it about this topic? Because I've got something else to say. Yeah, yeah. About, about, about yesterday. I want to ask you this about um, Gabby Yorov and I uh, saw so Jake, Jake Humphreys, right? Them giving interviews on Prime, but they on BBC. They work for BBC, right? Shearer. Don't they work for BBC? On Match of the Day? Oh, so okay, okay, so, so basically they're free agents, they can work anywhere they want. Yeah, yeah, because match of the day is only a highlight show, isn't it? It's not a full, it's not a full program. So then yeah, man, can, they... man can go to TNT and Amazon and all them thing there. Okay. I can okay. do that. But this is what I was gonna ask you. I don't know if they do it in NFL, but bo- in basketball, the cameras go into the changing room. You think that Premier League should do that? Yeah. Or should I say, do you want yeah. to say that? that, they're going, that they're going to, they, they, they're not used to go to the change room when they won the FA Cup back in the day, jumping yeah, in the yeah, bars yeah. and all of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They don't do that no more, innit? They don't do that no more. Right. You know why they don't do that? Because now you've got female reporters. But here's, this, here, but here's the thing now. If, if a female reporter is getting involved in a main or main dominating oriented games, yeah, and you want to do locker room shit, just know, don't be offended. And but no, you, you can't have that. They can't go in there. I'm, wait, I'm gonna wait. say it. The women can't go in the men's changing rooms. Why? Because you're not allowing the men to go in the women's changing room. In well, the you are today. Room. You are today. It's called gender neutral, bro. <laughs> you are today now. Come. <laughs> None. All I know is I know the women. The name, bro. I know the women ain't letting the men in their changing room. I know that for a fact. But, 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 but the thing is, yeah. But you see what that. The man that like, like, well, I know that the like NFL players, there's there's there bad women coming to the lockers, but the man them not gonna cater to them. Men don't care, bruv. They're not gonna cater to them. Them man just come out the shower, full butt naked, got the dick hanging. You do it, him and start butt naked in front of you. You do it. I'm in the towel in up. This is my room. I'm not even putting the towel. You're in my room. Yeah, bruv. Yeah, if you're uncomfortable, you 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 stop here. There's been clips of women. Interviewing and they're like, you guys, we're thinking all that, brother. We're exactly like, whoa, <laughs> stay on the job, stay on the job. <laughs> you know, you, you know, when you know, man wants to go into the woman's I one, they're, like, look, you know. they they're gonna go on my, and have their dinner at the dinner table. Oh my god, I was interviewing this player, man. He was there. Ah, I saw that player, hey, brother. You're in a room with 80 men, facts, called 100 men, facts, 50, 50 to 60 of them are butt naked. <laughs> yeah, the rest of the coaches got their gear on. <laughs> yeah, the women, the man that is buck naked, straight up. What's up, people? Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel.